Hello honey bunnies, welcome back. It's me Jenny. How is everyone doing? Okay, so we are going to create today these super adorable cute little witch brooms, okay? These accessories or embellishments are super cute to use in a Halloween theme um, project, maybe a goodie bag, maybe as cupcake toppers, even as favors. They're super cute to make. They're super adorable and very easy, okay? So I'm gonna show you how to make these Halloween inspired witch um, brooms, okay? You can even stand them up if you want. See how they stand up by themselves if you want on a table as display. A lot, you can do a lot with these, okay? And they're so simple to make. So what you're going to need for this project is basically straws. You're going to need some straws. If you have Halloween straws, that would obviously be the best. Um, if you have regular straws, don't worry. You can always washi tape your straws with Halloween washi tape that has like themes of Halloween. And this way, you save yourself some money and you can use just regular straws, okay? On this one that I have here, I kind of wrapped around the washi tape that I bought at Target not too long ago, which is this one. And as you can see on this one, I wrapped around the washi tape using this one, okay? So it's very simple. You're also going to need some streamers. Um, I have black streamer. And I'm also going to use orange streamer. You can use whatever colors you want. It's your choice. It doesn't really matter. You're going to need some twine. You're going to need some ribbon. Um, you're going to need your hot glue, scissors, and some other little embellishments to decorate your broom. Okay? So, the first thing you're going to do is take your straw and you're going to cut your straw in half. This way, you have two little brooms that you can um, embellish, okay? So this is a straw that I cut in half. I don't have any washi tape on it. It's just simple, regular straw that I got at Michael's, okay? So take your streamer, whichever streamer you're going to use. I'm going to use this black one. And cut a fair amount. Um, depending on the length of the streamer, obviously depends on how thick you want your broom to be okay so once you have your streamer you're going to fold your streamer in half okay you're gonna take your scissors and you're gonna start just basically making little slits like this okay you're not gonna go all the way to the top because if you go all the way to the top then it's not gonna be um, exactly what you want okay so just make little like little Slits like this, not going all the way to the top, and um, just very quick and easy. Okay, and then once you get to the end of the fold, don't cut the fold, leave that fold there. Okay, once you're done, you should get something like this. Okay, and now you're gonna fold this in half again okay and then you're gonna get something like this these ends hot glue them together so they don't come apart on you very small amount of glue you don't need a lot just a tiny amount of glue so this way you can adhere together the corners get your straw okay and you're going to add some hot glue onto the corner of your streamer just like so you're going to get your straw and you're going to add your straw right into that corner. Okay? Simple. You're going to roll over just like this around the straw. And every once in a while, you're going to add a little bit of hot glue. Okay? So, you're going to roll. Okay? Just like that. See that? And I'm going to add a little bit of hot glue. And you're going to roll it. And you're going to add hot glue. 
so every every once in a while you'll just add hot glue because the hot glue is going to help you adhere your streamer together okay that's why we're doing the hot glue okay you guys want me to zoom in let me zoom in a little bit so you can see how easy this is okay so again a little bit of hot glue and you're going to roll over your straw onto the streamer okay you get that and I'm gonna put some hot glue here and you're gonna roll you're gonna roll 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 and then you should get something like this okay all right very good now for the next step you're gonna take your twine okay and you're gonna wrap your twine around your broom how you're gonna do that is take up the end of the twine add a little bit of hot glue and you're gonna start roughly see this you're gonna start roughly around here and you're just gonna wrap this around pretty tight try to make it as tight as possible and then you're going to add hot glue okay as you go around with the twine you're going to stop at hot glue and keep going around so you're not going to add hot glue exactly everywhere but every once every turn or two like this see you're going to add hot glue so i turn here i'm going to add hot glue and you want to keep a good amount of pressure okay just like that and then we're going to add more hot glue okay i'm going to add a little bit of hot glue to the straw i'm going to wrap 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 and i think that's basically how i want it okay once you decide how you want it my recommendation is trim it off you don't need any extras okay then you're going to go back and you're just going to fill in the little extra little gaps that you have that you need to reinforce your glue with okay i have this one right here that i'm not too happy about i'm going to reinforce it a little bit and then i have this little tiny one that i just cut i'm going to add a little bit of hot glue and i'm going to reinforce this one as well okay and after you're done you should get something like this see that that is super cute and now the best part of this tutorial is we're going to embellish our witch broom so you either take some ribbon you take some leftover fabric um take some glitter ribbon whatever you want I'm going to use this glitter um, sparkly ribbon, okay, and I'm just going to basically make a cute little, like this, okay, I'm going to hot glue it, and then I'm going to hot glue this onto my broom, roughly around here, okay, just like that. And then you should get something like this. See that? That is super cute. That is the cutest witch broom ever. Okay? So now that you have your broom almost ready, you can always obviously just open up here very carefully. Open it up so it can kind of look like a broom. Messy or crazy. See that? super cute okay so now to finish decorating my broom i can either put a nice cute little bow right here or i can use some sequins i'm going to put a bow because i really like the way this bow contrasts against the glitter ribbon so i'm going to do that i'm going to use this bow and i'm going to trim off the little 
bit of the edges okay I'm going to use my hot glue and I'm going to adhere this bow right here in the center of my ribbon see that and there you have yourself a cute adorable simple witch broom okay these are super cute guys I love these let me make one more for you so you can see how easy it is okay we're gonna do the one that's washi tape so as you can see here I washi tape the whole straw I still have a little bit here left over I'm gonna finish that washi I'm gonna finish that little spot right there okay and I'm gonna washi tape it really quickly and then for this one I'm going to use orange um orange okay there you go see there's your straw covered in washi tape okay so let's do an orange broom i have here already this cut out on the side okay relatively a large amount i'm going to fold it in half okay I'm going to use my scissors and I'm going to start snip, snip, snip very carefully, making sure that I don't go all the way to the top. Because it has to be exactly perfect, okay? As you can see here, I'm not really doing it perfectly. Now, this is going to be folded over to this side, just like that. And we're going to hot glue the corners. Okay. And you should get something like this. All right. We're going to get a straw. Let me cut a little bit this here. Okay. There we go. You're going to get a straw. Okay. You're going to add some hot glue to this corner right here. And you're going to roll your straw into that corner and you're just going to roll. Okay, you see that? And that's how you sh that's what you should get. Every roll, every once in a while, just hot glue so they can stay together. Okay, and we're going to roll. Roll. Okay. Again, some hot glue, and we're going to roll, 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 and roll. See how easy this is? Very simple and easy. Okay, once you get to the end, okay, there we go, and there you have it. This is what it looks like so far. Okay, now we're going to take our twine or ribbon. In this case, I'm using twine. Okay, you're going to hot glue the twine roughly around here. Okay. Roughly around here. Just like that. And you're going to go around with a good force. Okay, you want this to be tight. But not super tight, but obviously tight enough that you don't want this to fall apart, okay? So every every once in a while, add a little bit of hot glue. Okay. Flip it around. Around. A little bit of more hot glue. You definitely want to go around the straw okay you don't want to stay concentrated only on this area you want to go around this area and you want to make sure you go at least once or twice around the straw okay because that's going to keep your broom together once you get to the end okay use your hot glue and you're going to hot glue this to the straw 
very carefully so you don't get burned. See that? There you have your broom, guys. Look how easy that was. Your orange broom. That's super cute. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to decorate this broom with some lace and some ribbon. I have, again, the same one that we used earlier. I have this piece of ribbon that I want to use. I'm going to add this ribbon into the center of my witch broom. I'm going to add this up somewhere roughly around here. Okay. There we go. And then, okay, and then I'm going to use this leftover fabric that I got from another project. I'm going to try to come, try to make a bow out of this tiny, tiny little fabric, but I like the combination of it. So let's see if this is going to work. I'm not sure it's going to work because this piece is pretty tiny. So we shall see. Yeah, it's going to be hard. This strip is very, very tiny. Let's see. Let's try again. Okay, there you go I managed to make a bow don't ask me how but I managed to make a bow okay there you go and I made this cute little bow from fabric scrap see them I'm gonna hear this cute little bow onto my witch broom okay and we're gonna add this roughly around here that's gonna give our witch broom a cute effect and there you have it guys if you want to get a little bit creative, you can always put maybe like a little spider right in the middle. Let's do that. Let's put a spider right in the middle of that bow. Just like that. And then maybe we can do, on this one, maybe we can put this back. The sequence back. Okay. go and there you have it guys that is how you create a very small and simple easy witch broom so much fun to create these i love these embellishments they're so cute okay and you have this one that we just created this is not even open yet but make sure you open your broom okay so if you want to see it ruffled and all um full just make sure you open it but generally, this is what you're going to get, okay? I wanted you guys to see how easy it is to make these cute little witch brooms. I hope you guys have fun. I hope you guys enjoy this small, adorable tutorial. Please let me know at the bottom of this video if you guys enjoyed this. And I hope you guys try it at home. When you make them, please tag me on Instagram so I can see your wonderful work. Um, thank you guys for stopping by. Thank you for subscribing and I will see you guys on my next video. Bye honeys. Have a fantastic week. Bye.